Hello friends, let us study one more case on with replacement and without replacement in the chapter probability. The problem is a bag contains 8 red and 5 white balls, that means total there are 13 balls. Two successive drawings of 3 balls are made such that balls are replaced before the first second draw, that means with replacement and balls are not replaced before the second row that means the case without replacement find the probability that the first drawing will give three white that means three white in the first row and the second drawing will give the three red balls that means three red in the second row again we solve the problem two times with replacement and without replacement. Let us calculate the probability under the scenario of with replacement. Three balls are drawn out of 13. Three balls out of 13. That means first of all we have to simplify 13 C3. 13 C3 give us 286. In the first row, we expect three white balls and in the second three red. Three white balls out of five is five C3. Total 13 C3. Now these three balls, rather three white balls are replaced. That means again there are 13 balls. There are eight red balls, five white balls and total 13 balls. And now the second row is made. We expect three red balls. So it could be. 8C3 divided by 13C3. 5C3 gives us value 10. 13C3 gives us value 286. Multiplied by 8C3 gives us value 56. And 13C3 again 286. So the result is 10 into 56, 560. Divided by 286 into 286, that is 81,796. If we simplify, we can divide this by 4. So the final result will be 140 divided by 20,449. Yes, 20,449. This is the probability of drawing 3 white balls in the first draw and 3 red balls in the second draw. If the balls drawn in the first draw are replaced or with replacement. Now the case of without replacement that means the three balls drawn in the first draw are not replaced in the second. Probability of three white balls in the first draw and three red in the second. In the first row there are 13 balls. We are going to draw three balls. The combination is the same. First 3 white 5C3 upon 13C3. But now these 3 balls are not replaced. That means at the time of second drawing there will be 13 minus 3. Total 10 balls. But we believe that in the first draw we have drawn 3 white balls so there will be no change in the total number of red balls there remain 8 8 c3 divided by 10 c3 yes 8 c3 divided by 10 c3 see the difference between these two here at the time of second row Two, there are 13 balls because the balls taken in the first row are replaced. In this case, the balls taken in the first row are not replaced. So, there are 13 minus 3, 10 balls at the time of second row. This is the difference between with replacement with and without replacement cases. Yes, 5C3 is 56 and 13C3 is 286 into 8C3. It remains 56, sorry 5C3 is not 56, it was my mistake, it was 10, 
Yes, tan C3. What is tan C3? Tan C3 comes to 120. So the result is 560 divided by 34,320. If we simplify the numbers, the ultimately we get 7 divided by 429. Yes, I have already simplified the numbers in my paper. So I am writing it directly. This is the difference between the probabilities under two different scenarios popularly known as with replacement and without replacement. In consecutive random selections, there can be with replacement cases or without replacement cases. I think or I, uh, I hope you get it. Every time my lectures are helpful to you and I hope you use it for your knowledge, for learning the subject and for getting great score in your examinations. Thank you. All the best.